One of the biggest differentiators of Techstars globally is the corporate network you've put together and corporate partnerships and helping startups get connected into the enterprise market. What do you think has been the secret to that success? It's really one plus one equals three, right? Because when a startup comes through a corporate program, they get extra mentorship around that particular vertical. They sort of have a built-in potential customer and they have a huge Rolodex of people that uh, the corporate partner can help introduce them to. Well, and it's interesting, you talk about uh, how corporate partners often aren't ready to actually partner with tech stars. So you help groom them, you help uh, refine their internal workings to make sure that it's actually something positive for both parties. How, how do you do that? That's part of why they partner with us. They want to speak startup, if you will, and uh, learning how to interact with startups doesn't always come naturally to every big company in the world. And so helping them understand the strengths and the weaknesses of startups and how they think is a big part of what we do. So how does that look in a typical uh, corporate example? It starts off with corporate executives coming and participating in the program and meeting the entrepreneurs. Uh, they're often super surprised at both how disorganized they are right. and how fast they are, right, at the same time. And that is the magic, right, seeing how quickly they move because every corporate would love to move at startup speed. Um, but at the same time, you got to work through the disorganization part. One of the other big differentiators you have at Techstars is the mentors, the mentor network generally, globally, and yeah. the mentor program. How do you think about the best mentors? The best mentors are willing to give first, right? They aren't transactional. They're not thinking about what they're going to get. They just want to help with no expectation of anything in return. And give first is one of our core values. Um, but it doesn't mean get never, right? It really means life doesn't have to be transactional. And if I give you something, it'll pay itself back to me in the future and magical and wonderful ways. And does that usually with mentors work in terms of friendships and relationships, or does it also work in terms of investment? Mentors will come and say, I came to give, and then I wound up getting more, right? Because they learn about what's happening in, an, in a startup ecosystem, or they meet some really smart people, or it changes the way uh, that they think, or maybe they have an opportunity to invest in one of the startups, and maybe they didn't even uh, go in thinking about it, but they just fell in love with the company or the person or the CEO um, and decided to invest some of their dollars in making that company successful. David, when you look forward uh, for Techstars, there's obviously a whole lot of different incubators and accelerators in the marketplace with various forms of specialization. What does the future look like for Techstars? Where are you taking it? Um, well, uh, I can answer that in a couple of dimensions. You know, one is geographic, right? The world is a big place and there's entrepreneurs that have that uh, DNA all around the world. And while in North America, you know, there are plenty of opportunities for entrepreneurs, that might not be true in all parts of the world. And I think it's part of our mission to help places around the country and around the world that maybe don't have as much opportunity to bring more uh, entrepreneurship. So this is the idea that in a city or in a country even that does not have a significant startup ecosystem, right. you see Techstars as actually a genesis, a, a creation platform for that ecosystem. Absolutely. And you know, my personal story is I'm from Montreal. And uh, when I started in my first startup in Montreal in the 1980s, there was no ecosystem. And it caused me to leave my hometown, which I loved, uh, to go seek opportunity elsewhere. Now, I had that opportunity to do that, but not everybody does. And the business model of Techstars is one of taking a modest equity stake. Is that the long-term business model? 100%. We're investors. And uh, it's a great model because we take common shares. We are aligned with the founders. You know, we like to say, think of us as a junior co-founder. We're there to help. We don't take control. We don't take a board seat. And if you're successful, we participate in your success. And if not, we'll go have a beer together.